Now, say in this question, a ray of light incident at an angle of 60 degree on one face of a 30 degree with the incident ray. And now, show that the emergent ray is normal to the surface from which it emerges. So, you have to show that the emergent ray is normal to the surface. And now, here calculate the refractive index. See here, if you take a prism like this, in this way, if the prism is like this is here, we can take this is a normal, this angle is 30 degree, this angle is of 60 degree. Now, this refracts and goes like this and it straight away it is a normal. So, obviously, in this case when you produce this, so here the deviation you will be getting that is of 30 degree in this case and when the deviation is of 30 degree. So, you can write here I 1 is equal to 60, A is equal to 30 and deviation is equal to 30 degree. When the deviation is equal to here 30 degree, so you can write delta is equal to I plus E minus A here 30 plus 30 is equal to 60 plus E minus 30. So, here E is equal to 0. If angle of emergence is 0, it means the ray is emerging out normal to the surface. If it is emerging out normal to the surface, this one it means angle of emergence is 0. Now, we have to calculate refractive index of the material. So, we know angle A is equal to R 1 plus R 2 already we have done. If E is equal to 0 already we have shown obviously, R 2 is equal to 0 R 2 for the second surface. So, we can write A is equal to R 1 that is R 1 is equal to 30 and we know it mu is equal to sin i upon sin r. So, mu is equal to sin i 1 upon sin r 1 that is here sin 60 divided by sin 30 here root 3 divided by 2 is 1 by 2 to 2 cancel here that we can write mu is equal to root 3. So, in this case refractive index of the material is mu is equal to under root of 